is Man 70 here. I wanted to do a recap from the Mansfield uh, card show we went to today. Picked up a few things, nothing major. Um, Jake picked up some uh, Topps Chrome, which I'm sure he'll show you guys on the next video. Um, picked up uh, some supplies, picked up some penny sleeves and uh, pop loaders. Went, um, saw the Brad Parker, the Boston Bruins was there today. Uh, Orlando Cabrera of the Red Sox, 2004 World Champs. Um, there's a couple of other people there. The next card show is going to be, uh, is it Oil, Oil Can Void? Is going to be there. Lyndon Byers of the Bruins, Dino Raja for the Celtics. And there's a few more listed that are coming. But that should be good. Uh, one is on Labor Day, and the next one is September, I think, 16th or something like that. So these are some of the pickups I, I grabbed while I was there. Grabbed this um, Todd Gurley from Limited. Pretty nice. Picked up this Eli Manning from Majestic. It's numbered 62 out of 75. Got this uh, Drew Brees from Plates and Patches. I don't remember the video that I was watching, but I was watching this video and someone had made a comment about, about this particular cards and they said that they didn't like the fact that they put a zero in front of the single number. I didn't know what they meant until I actually grabbed this one. And this is 03 out of 99. No idea why you would put that zero there. I don't know why. Why not just 3 out of 99 would be good. Then I picked up this, another majestic card. This one is David Johnson, 56 out of 75. Then, while we were there, they had a, which they do this, I think, once or twice a year. They had um, a scavenger hunt, and you go around, and they usually have Pedro Martinez, David Ortiz, relic cards, and maybe somebody else. But this time around, it was Ortiz and, and Pedro, and you go around, and they have these relic cards hanging around the table. You got to try to find them. So Jake found a David Ortiz relic. I found a David Ortiz relic, and we both found Pedro's. So these are mine. I found this David Ortiz. And then I found this one. It's uh, Game 1 jerseys. It's Carlos Beltran and Pedro Martinez. And it's numbered 33 out of 50. Pretty nice card. So we got those. Um, I have a question for everybody. I recently downloaded the PSA registry app. Even though I do buy most of my cards from, well, get most of my cards graded from GMA. But I do pick up PSA cards once in a while. Um, and I wanted to have them, you know, do a registry on them and have it mobile on my phone. Figured it would be wicked easy to be able to look things up while I'm at a card show or trying to pick up some other cards. When I went into the app, it's a pretty cool app. It tells you, you know, the, the certified number of the card once you scan it in. Um, it tells you the actual number of the card the player, 
um, the grade. Um, it's pretty good. If It even tells you the cost of the card on some of them. But it has a section where it says population, and, and I'm just assuming that that means what they call the pop, which I would guess is the amount of cards of that particular card that's graded. And then right underneath it has something called population higher. I don't know what that means. It's another number. I've been trying to find it online. Can't find the answer. Don't know what that means. If anybody knows, can you please comment below and let me know? All right, I will uh, be making another video probably tomorrow. Got some other ideas about the channel and stuff. I will talk to you guys soon. Peace.